Hey guys, this is Cage Kid One, and I just wanted to show you guys another one of my favorite, crap, one of my favorite apps um, by Go Launcher. It is Go SMS Pro, and I think it's really good. So I just want to show you guys that right quick. Click on that, and then you have that's really not what comes up, but right here you see you have all the people, and you have all their pictures, and <laughs> you can see all my friends. Whatever. You have their pictures, and if you click on one, you can see their you can see their name and their number. So at least you know what their number looks like in case you ever just randomly see it one day. I have no idea. I think you can turn that off. I'm not too sure. Then you have basically it's not like the stock at all. It's so much easier to use and just so much simpler. If you click on this little thing, you create a new message, you just click there, you type someone's name in, add them, or click this little button to add um, a lot of people, get out of that. You click your options button, you have your theme, basically you just have a lot of themes that you can be on, and yeah, I only use one, I only need one I really don't like my SMS's SMS's ha 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 my text to look all that fancy I just want to see what someone's saying and respond and be done with it in a nice little way um he's good to talk to you. um here you can call them or I really don't know what this does we'll see running mode Oh, I don't really know what that is. I don't care, so I'm just going to click OK. Here at the bottom, if you guys can see that, you have smileys. which And they're just cute little smileys. I mean, people from the other phone see them just the same. But I want to um, show you guys these little, the iPhone smileys. They are also here. I don't know if my phone will focus for you guys. But if you click, see, you see all of the little iPhone smileys and these are so nice because you can talk to your little iPhone friends and make fun of each other with these and you even have these little things they're little animals and little shapes and little penguins and buildings and Santa apparently obviously you have Santa Claus and now these are the buildings blah 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 then these I mean they're very nice they're very cute they're helpful I mean I don't really use them that much but they are definitely quote unquote nice to have here you have the uh, talk to text or you just speak and I think it's recording me right now so I'm gonna click cancel because I don't want to send my friend that and something I really like and I really think is cute is you can draw to your friends um, you see it says handwriting and I'm just gonna put I see it goes there La Oh, misplaced E. Go S M S Pro. And there it has I love Go S M S Pro. And if I sent that, it would send. And you also have a doodle option where you can doodle. You can change the color. That's purple. Change it to blue or something. That's blue. If you guys can see. Um the size have it ginormous and just destroy everything la, 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 la. and the shape um I like that like fuzzied out shape that's cute to me you have your little eraser erase everything everything dies <laughs> anyway having a little too much fun you click the options you have clear insert images share and insert clip art which means you can just insert a picture and then draw over that and that I think is just the funnest thing in the world um if you click it'll say um the doodle will be cleared if you leave I don't want to send it so okay and then you go back um another thing that I want to show you guys that I think that I really just love about this if you click right there it says MMS which is um multimedia message I don't know what the S is for. And um, you have options where it's pictures in your gallery 
to capture pictures, videos, to capture video, audios, record audios, and then the slideshow of everything that you've sent. And for the pictures, I think it's very cool because you click on a picture, gallery, right now I'm going to find a random picture, um, here. I like these type of shoes and you have options you see that you click on them and then it changes I don't know if you guys can see that very well but it is changing and they look they look very very good and I was really impressed because I really never saw any apps that did this before because I look through apps like that anyway and click reset it's back to normal or you click on a setting and then you click apply and then there it is you can see it you can view it you can rotate it you can enlarge it you can zoom out of it and then you have replace pick another picture it gives you all the options that were on the previous screen all over again or you can remove it, it says converting to text message eh who knew um, one thing I really want to show you guys is the, um, settings, because the settings are very, they're very customizable, especially the appearance settings, the themes, the font packages, um, in case you guys didn't see, those, oh, are not regular fonts, they are very customized by me, no crap, um, and I love it. And then you have notifications. One thing I want to tell you guys, um, when you go to notifications, it says default notification settings. If you click to have, where is it? Uh, come on, be visible. Oh, is it not going to be visible for me? <sighs> okay, here we go. If you have screen on, when you get a message and the screen turns on, you will not be able to get um, the flashing LED light. And it took me so long to figure that out, and I just really want to let you guys know that because it annoyed the crap out of me. And I hated it. I hated it, and I was so confused. I was like, why is it not showing? But that's how you do that.